Hello everybody, welcome and welcome back to my channel. My name is Kubra, also known as It's Miss K. Thank you so much for joining me and tuning into today's video. I hope everybody's doing good. Yeah, March is gone. March came and went like this. Like, honestly, it baffles me to realize how fast the time goes. That being said, in today's video, I'll be doing my cash stuffings for my weekly saving challenges. And this is going to be for week 12, all right? so boom let me just jump into today's video make it quick because your girl's tired all right so first things first let me go ahead and pull out my bills and you know what i just realized that i will not be stuffing my march madness envelope and i'm like Ooh, i feel kind of sad because i love stuffing like an additional envelope which was like you know not my regular saving challenges and also i know my budget bestie here on youtube her name is rab's wallet make sure you guys check her out she has a new challenge um along with a garden of thought and it's called i think the rain or shine challenge in which you'd be putting money away um for your debts specifically targeting your debts in order for you to pay off your debts quicker and i'm like i'm not sure whether i want to actually i do want to join this challenge and because first of all their envelope is super cute okay and i kind of want to have the envelope in my savings challenges i know that's not a good enough reason but hey it is for me so I'm debating. Um, I'm not sure if I can or cannot. It will be amazing to put an extra, I don't know, 100 or so into my debt this month as well. Um, but yeah, so let me know, y'all. Let me know if y'all are partaking into the Rain or Shine Challenge and maybe help me make a decision in it. So today we'll be stuffing 5, 25, 45, 65, 85, 135. 140 145 and 150 so i'll be stuffing 150 dollars into my savings challenges and of course oh i'll always forget the coins see remember how last time i told you guys how the saving challenge i mean the coin saving challenge became boring to me now you can tell because i always forget to take out the change from my wallet okay so that's it and y'all know the drill we always start with the smallest challenge first hence the coin challenge and let me just put this binder aside so i have enough space for now and then let me also move this wallet because i won't need it and i'm going to be quickly laying my bills down So yeah, like I was saying, I'm debating as to whether I should join the challenge um, simply because I have a few things planned this month, inshallah, and I don't know if I'll be able to undertake another challenge. And yeah, I just want to make sure that these taking challenges are like not stressing me out, you know? So, but I love that envelope. It's super cute. So we'll see. We'll see what i can do okay so first things first um i already took out the sheets so here are my sheets and i'm going to be using this green cardstock today to put in between my sheets that way we want to update my sheets the ink does not seep through that being said let's go ahead and do the first challenge and where are my ch where's my change though okay so here i was contemplating very hard before filming this video because i was so tired but I told myself, yeah, if I do not film this video, I'm going to be like a few days late into my other um, releases. So I had to just get this going. So we'll be stuffing $2, $3, and $0.25, cents, $0.35. Cents. So three thirty-five is how much I'll be stuffing today. I've been having threes like how many weeks in a row. So three thirty-five, And y'all, I've been waiting to film my sticking fun update to see how much i've been saving but i'm gonna have to wait a little bit more so all right so this is my coin box which i'm going to put my change in not gonna lie for some reason i'm looking tired of this coin box i'm over it so i kind of want something different um yeah i don't know like i'm i'm over this one remember how at first i was like i'd rather not see my change because i feel like i'm going to be dipping into my change Right now, I feel like I am disciplined enough not to be even 
compelled to dip into my chain so i kind of want to see my change now if that makes sense all right so now that i'm done with my cones challenge let me go ahead and move to the next one and it is nope yeah. this one here which is the five dollar challenge so throughout the week of last week i was able to collect three five dollar bills um and change so we have one two three this is for another challenge so I was able to get three to five dollar change. That means we'll be stopping five dollars, ten dollars, fifteen dollars today for our five dollar challenge. So this is basically going to be wrapping up all the stuffings for Q1, which is great because I'll be filming my own stuffing video very soon. So I stopped fifteen dollars. Now let me go ahead and pull out the envelope for the month right here, and I'm going to add to it. So we're adding an extra 15. I cannot wait to see how much I have in here. And also I've seen a lot of you guys saying um, you really like the $10 bill, which I do not have on me right now. But yeah, but that is your favorite um, bill in the Canadian currency. I personally love the $5 bill. I guess I just love blue so much. And yeah, that's the color that resonates with me the most. I really love this blue right here. Alright, so the $5 challenge is all done. Moving on to our next challenge. We have the 52 week roundup challenge. So for this challenge, last week I stopped week 6 envelope. Hence, I put in $15. And then this week I'll be stuffing week 47's envelope. Alright, so let me go ahead and pull out the envelope real quick. And see. So week 47 is this envelope right here cute but not cute enough <sighs> all right so let's go ahead and do the breakdown together real quick again for my 52 week challenge i always double the amount that i put in so i should be putting in 94 dollars but since i rounded up i'll be stuffing 95 dollars today all right so i'll be putting in 150 and then Two twenties and the last five. Okay, so let me just double check that this is correct. So 50, 70, 90, 95. So 95 is how much I'll be putting into this envelope right here. Why is it sticking? Okay. So let me fold this up. Honestly, I feel like me rounding up this 52 week challenge makes it so easier for me, especially because we don't have dollar bills and I wouldn't want to hustle with making sure i have a dollar coin on me so that's it let me go ahead and seal this up with a sticker all right so what should we go for today um you know what let's go with this one with love let's go oh what's going on here yeah. let me go ahead and use this one i'm gonna close it up boom that's it that's simple all right so i'm gonna put it back into the tray where it belongs make sure it's organized so i don't have to redo it later all right so I'll put it back into my tray okay so we stuffed 95 dollars that being said um i'm going to highlight next week's stuffing that way i know we're going to be stuffing this week which is going to be week seven's envelope let me go ahead and highlight week seven so next week, that's the envelope I'll be stuffing, which means I'll be stuffing $15. All right, so this is perfect. Moving on to our next challenge. We have the 2021 cash in challenge. Last week, I put in $45 for the beginning of the five week cycle. Again, the 2021 challenge, I simply put in $41 every week, but you know me, I don't like having change on me. So what I do is I do it on a five week cycle, which means the first week I'll be putting in $45. So that will be a $5 bill, which will cover the $1 for five weeks. All right, that way I don't need to worry. So last week I stuffed the first week cycle, which was $45 in which I put in. So today I'll be stuffing $40, all right? So let me put in $40 Let make sure we got the 40. So we have the $40 right here. Let me put it in right here, update the tracker. Okay, and then my 2021 cashing challenge, I'll leave it in my Sinking fun binder 
this one right here so let me pull out the tracker as well I'll update full trackers to make sure update the date twenty dollars you guys just need to wait a few more days until I reveal my big on stuffing. I'm curious to know how much I stuff because I have no idea. Okay, so that's it. Okay, so let me put this back. Are you excited for the new month? Because I know I am. Spring is actually one of my favorite seasons. If not my favorite, to be honest. All right, so we're all done with the saving challenges. So I also figured I will give you a quick update on the 26 week 10,000 challenge, $10,000 challenge, I mean. So for this one, hold on. Let me get my life together real quick. This challenge, I always stuff it whenever I do my cash stuffings, simply because it is the biggest challenge that I am doing and it just makes it easier for me. And that also gives you guys an idea of how much I'm aiming on saving for the year of 2021. That being said, we did stuff 385 um, a few days ago when I was doing my cash stuffing. So let me go ahead and update that. So 385. And when I did the calculation, we were at $2,310, which means that I'll be putting in a um I'll be putting in a brand new replacement slip. Let me just double check something here. Let me make sure. Which color should the diamonds be this time? Because I kind of want to switch it up. I kind of want to do a different color for the replacement slip. Let me know in the comments. I have blue, red, of course the gold. All right, so yes, $2,310 is our current balance for the 10K challenge. So I'm going to be bringing the money into the bank once I'm done my cash on stuffing video. That way I don't have to be going to the bank as often. So we're all done with the saving challenges, done with updating this one. Again, I can't wait to film my update to see how far I came. But yeah, guys, that's pretty much it for today's video. I'm happy I filmed today because I knew if I didn't film today, I would be overthinking about it tomorrow. And thank you so much for tuning in. As always, I appreciate you putting your time and energy into my video. And all your support you guys have been so supportive, especially toward the last video that I posted. Um, I am so grateful and I'm so humbled by all your support and your love. So I really truly appreciate every single one of you and your kind words. That being said, I will catch you in my next video. And until then, stay blessed, alright? Peace and love. Bye.